Hello everyone, I'll come over here. Welcome back to Pokemon Shield. So in the last video, we got the Fire Gym badge and Hop decided to fight Bayday or whatever. So a few things were done. In the meantime, I uh, did a little more farming and moving about in the uh, the Wild Zone. So Raboot has evolved to Cinderace. I've also uh, also moved a lot of my evolutions down here, so I got a lot of evolutions in the meantime. So I am I, I am uh, regretful that I did not get to show these evolutions they evolved. So that's a that's an unfortunate thing about it. They evolved kind of without you guys seeing it, and I'll admit that was kind of a, a dick move on my part. I should have showed you guys these awesome evolutions, etc. But well. <sighs> Honestly, I just kind of got really ahead of myself on that one, I'll admit. I kind of got really immersed in what I was doing to the point where I, uh, I just kept playing and playing, and I completely forgot to record. So, uh, this video will be a, a bit longer than the last one, hopefully. And, uh, again, I do apologize that I didn't really show you guys do the process of the evolution, because um, uh, my thought on the matter was... I'm doing this and showing you guys really the story of the game, not the process of me grinding and grinding and grinding. But, uh, at the end of the day, I know you guys really wanted to probably see the evolution. So, with that, I am sorry. And I will try to keep this grinding to a minimum. I don't th I don't really think I need to do anything more uh, severe or extreme in terms of grinding. I say that with a giant maybe. I'm just going over. Because I know, I, I'm pretty sure you guys have seen these before. But just going over. Because I know I've been moving them left and right. And actually, I'm actually I'm actually super I'm actually super impressed with how much I've been catching so far because when I played this, I honestly did not, and I mean literally, did not expect to really get this many. I I did not. I literally thought I would just go through the master list, look at the team I wanted, and just go from there. I did not expect to catch as many as I did. So with that, I'm quite proud of myself. But aside from that, uh, it's a take it or leave it. But regardless, let's carry on to the next town. These guys are uh, kind of tough. God damn it. Ah, ah well, zigzagoon. Nice oh yeah, we we'll in the race. Yeah, one thing I did learn is a lot of the big pillars for the Dynamax battles for farming purposes, they also extend all the way out here once it is kind of unlocked that you can come here. So, there are a few chances that you will go here and... Oh, oh no, I can't take that on. Uh, there will be many chances where you will come, try to take it on, and you'll be like, and I lost. That, that happened to me. Like, a lot. What do you got to sell? Uh, Dying Bell, Wishing Peace, uh, 
Yeah, nothing I really need, need, so... This looks like some good ingredients. I got a lot of money. No, no, I didn't mean like that. <laughs> Okay, well, screw you, guy. <laughs> Fucking Bay Day. I don't even care that Hop lost. Let's just check out the gym before, I mean, the Pokemon Center. Okay. I don't know what I was doing there. I don't think I actually fight this gym leader. I think he's literally the last stop on the list. So this will be more, I guess, me following the, going around the town. I don't think I'll be fighting in a gym battle on this. And again, nothing worth fashion for me. There's literally nothing. Ugh. Swear to God, I'm probably gonna keep. I, here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna like change my style once, hate it, and then change it back. Yeah, I need a quick. Li Let's have a quick battle, guy. I think I can beat you. Not feeling confident about my teacup, but uh, I, th I think I got this. I'm not confident about this teacup. Let's get Pupitar out here. 
Uh, try another pyro ball. Yeah, superpower. If it lives long enough. Oh, it missed. Alright. Holy crap. Cubitar. The fuck? Oh well, let's just get the teacup back out here. That big ass psychic guy! <laughs> I, I didn't really make a plan B on this one! No, oh well, that works. No, I'm, st I'm still here. I'm still here. There's just a lot in this area. Uh-huh. That battle's not gonna go anywhere good. Uh... And fuck you, Team Yell. Ugh. People have no class. Uh, yeah, I'll take one. Uh, only Cinderace? Uh, sure. A fire pledge. Uh, yes, I'll take it. It does a lot of damage. Especially because it's a grass type. And it's stronger than headbutt. Okay, that was, uh, interesting, I think.
Again, more Team Yell douchebaggery. Uh, I guess up here then. All right, time to learn more about uh, Galar history. Yay! What if I was just a really stupid kid wanting to do Pokemon battles? Why do I want to learn history? Ah, oh, well, no choice, I guess.
Okay. Uh huh. Uh huh. So the darkest day was just uh, shit happening, and then two heroes saved the day and became king and founded the kingdom, and that's how we got Galar. Oh, cool. Now I can finally try. So yeah, that was essentially just me in this town. So about half the video was just me learning a little more lore about the place. Oh well. I really don't know what they're hoping to get, because I will ultimately annihilate them. And time for round two, where I will, once again, show these morons I'm amazing. Seriously, I don't need- Cinderace alone is enough to take them on.
All right, so now just the usual travel to the next town and battle along the way. This is going to be a lovely adventure, and of course, a random... The selection of trainers. I mean, I get it. You don't want it to be too stale fighting the same hikers, other trainers, etc., etc., but I don't know. I feel like they could have really upped this game a bit more by making it more... I don't know, realistic? I don't know, I don't think a beauty would be out here heading off into like, I don't, I don't, where the fuck am I, a plateau? Heading into the mountains? Um, but then at the same time, I don't want to have the exact same people over and over. I think, I think it'd be kind of cool if we had, uh, if they introduce a new type of uh, trainer, the gym challengers, people that, you know, are trying to challenge the gym leaders. Since it doesn't, they play it off like there's a lot, but there really isn't. That's just the thing about it. Oh, a yeah, mask. I don't want them, actually. No, I don't want you. I already have one of you. Let's just go this way. Like, time stopped when I was on the ladder. It's like the Pokeballs were floating in midair. That's, uh, interesting. Also, why are... A, a plea, is that a doctor and a scientist? Or just two doctors and a nurse? Or two doctors? I... I don't know. What? What? Medical team. Okay, they're just a medical team. But... Why? A medical team out here. We're in the mountains. I expect hikers, maybe some other trainers, but that's about it. I don't expect a medical professional, beauty, even a camper I could understand. And once again, another team bites the dust. Back 
that backpacker makes sense. Even a martial artist, I could kind of understand. Oh, don't worry. I'm just gonna. I'll I'll keep ranting about that for a little bit longer. Then I'll eventually stop, or I'll bitch and moan in the next video. Ah, uh, there is never when you when you do this after a while. When you uh, that is one sturdy ass Pokemon. When you uh, play games long enough, after a while, you kind of recognize a pattern, and then you just kind of uh, complain about the pattern. That's that's essentially how a lot of these types of videos go. I mean, I don't know. I don't really have much to say. It, it's Pokemon. It's extremely straightforward. You capture animals, put them in balls, throw them out, have them fight, you win. Ta-da! Change up the lore here and there, add some interesting dynamics, because I do like this whole Kaiju Dynamax method. It does look cool. Alright, that backpacker's doing a little scouting. Uh, let's see if we don't find the grass here, because I thought I saw something good. Yep, there we go. Ooh, Steel Wing. That's, uh, not bad. I could probably give it to Corviknight. Yeah, do I have to, like, run in front of you as you're trying to get confused? You guys need to carry more than one Pokemon. This this is just too easy. It's not worth it. Then I'd have to run all the way back up and everything, and I just don't think that's worth the effort. Not worth the care, in my opinion. see a campsite over there. Okay, that is just obvious. Like, what? Are you even trying to hide the dig? Of course. Couldn't even, like, have a bunch of dig or dug trios around here. No, you just had to... Yeah. Nah, I'm not feeling it this time.
Alright, just some light clay. What do we got over here? You are... What? That sounds... Okay, that sounds really stupid. That just, um, it kind of takes a lot from... So, again, okay, I've had this rant once before. I don't know if I ever did it in this video series, but it just... I don't like how some Pokemon are just unnecessary. Like, Pokemon from space... They don't belong here on Earth. Uh, Pokemon that are just, like, artificial creations that become Pokemon. That guy's a little creepy. I think he's huffing too much coughing gas. But yeah, it's just like, and now, it's like, I can understand bringing back fossil Pokemon, because those Pokemons were there, like, you know, millions of years ago. But when we're combining fossils, we're taking two Pokemon and shoving them together. It just doesn't work. It just feels weird to me. I just, I don't, personally, I don't like it. If it looks, I mean, if it looks cool, I guess, but again, that's very situational, and I don't really want to try to look for it. I, I really don't. Hmm. Yeah. I'm getting rid of something a little weaker, but Thrash could be pretty cool. Or pretty useful, actually. Okay, now you got a pseudo Wudo. Cool. Nice rock type. Going against my fire type, you think you're at a disadvantage, but uh, let me tell you something Zen Headbutt. Alright, Cinderace, let's do that again. And that's how you do it. Wow. More... T God, artists here are so creepy. They're so goddamn creepy. Heal you up. All right, and uh, I guess people worship Diglett over here. Oh, well, it looks like we're in the next town now, so we're gonna stop right here. So, thank you so much for watching. Share, subscribe. Let me know what you think. Leave comments below, and I will be with you next time. Thank you and goodbye.